Hi, I'm Colin Steele, Site Editor for SearchServerVirtualization.com. We're here today with David Davis, vSphere video training author, and we're going to talk about the server choices for virtualization. Thanks for joining us, David. Thanks for having me, Colin. What should you look for when buying hardware for virtualization projects? Well, in many ways, um, buying hardware for virtualization is not much different from buying hardware for any other you know, typical physical server um, in the sense that you're looking for reliability, uh, expandability, and performance. Um, to me, what makes uh, the difference when you go shopping for virtualization hardware is that you really want to look for CPU and RAM performance and expandability. Um, RAM seems to be you know, one of the big bottlenecks, especially when you drive up the consolidation ratios on a server. Um, local storage, um, unlike a, a typical physical server, local storage really isn't going to be that uh, utilized because you're going to have some shared storage uh, that you'll be putting all those virtual machines on. So again, RAM and CPU um, performance and expandability is what I would look for. What are some of the new hardware options that are available and related to virtualization? Well, um, some of the newest virtualization options that I've seen that have been really exciting, uh, the first one is the new Cisco uh, Unified Computing System, or the UCS, uh, which is sort of a, a data center in a box, if you will. It's got uh, servers, it's got storage, it's got networking, uh, it's got a virtualization uh, application that, that manages all of this infrastructure. Uh, it's really high performance and expandable, and, and it's tailored you know, just for virtualization. Um, I've also seen a number of options like uh, Pivot 3's serverless computing, which is, uh, again, a similar concept, but uh, on a much smaller scale. It's like a server with storage uh, and virtualization software all in a box. It's an appliance, a virtualization appliance, if you will. And you can link these appliances together to create a shared storage area network across the appliances. And uh, if any one of the appliances fail, thanks to uh, virtualization high availability features, but also thanks to their storage area network software that distributes the virtual machine data across the servers, uh, none of the virtual machine data is lost and none of the virtual machines failed. So uh, it sort of cuts out the typical expensive uh, storage area network and puts it all together in one box. And then for um, I.O. virtualization, one of the exciting options I've seen is uh, Zygo's I.O. director, uh, which really eliminates so much of the cabling that you typically have for Ethernet and fiber channel. Uh, could it potentially eliminate uh, most of your fiber channel ports, uh, which also eliminates a lot of expense and complexity. And then it gives you a lot of performance. Uh, uh, virtualizing the I.O. and allowing you to dynamically create new uh, I.O. adapters on your virtual servers. And finally, when it comes to hardware, is it better to scale up or to scale out? Uh, I hate to be political about you know, the answer, but I think a little bit of both is, is the right uh, way to go. I mean, you don't want to scale up too much um, because you'll end up spending uh, more than you need to on the price of the CPUs. You know, the, uh, the latest and greatest and fastest CPUs are always going to be the most expensive. So I think it's best to take kind of a middle of, road, middle of the road approach and get you know reasonably priced but fast CPUs in the servers, uh, a reasonable amount of RAM so that you don't have to buy the highest density uh, RAM you know that's out there, uh, and then also scale out at the same time. So scale out those middle of the road, uh, reasonably priced servers. David Davis, vSphere video training author. Thanks for your time. I'm Colin Steele, site editor for SearchServerVirtualization.com. Thanks for watching this video on the server choices for virtualization.